games. Yeah, most of the time you turn on Auburn, you're looking at this lineup, right? This is who you expect to see at Auburn, but they're all gone. New guys, Jones, Flanagan, Cambridge, Williams, Thor. It's a whole new look for the Auburn Tigers. Have they struggled a little bit? Yeah, maybe a little bit, but they're home. Back Justin Powell, the six foot six freshman out of Prospect, Kentucky, will start at the point. South Alabama is mostly a zone defensive team, and what a start this afternoon. I really trust his instincts. Played a little bit of point guard in high school. He trusts his instincts. He knows, though, that this Jaguar team is going to stay in that zone defense. And the coach really emulates how Bruce Pearl builds his program. He studied him for a long time, loves to play against him, loves how Auburn coaches. Currently applied by this group of Auburn Tigers as they get the steal here, so pretty productive. But it's really just to take time off. Flanagan attacking well, the basket, skip past they the Cambridge. Can, they can change it up. They can they can get after you and another good bucket by Powell that you play with. This down inside, Auburn looking to run once again. Good ball movement outside to Powell, who buries another three. And he that gives him more depth, another great player. If he's healthy, that's good. Chris Moore out of the corner. He in half. Auburn led it 28 to 12. Again, got off to a very quick start. Here's JT Thor. Bruce Pearl says, in due course, JT Thor. Wow. JT, I, I better not say anything. If you already said that, but when you take Thor, who's 6'10 outside, so he can see over the front line of that zone. And when the ball moves like that, how crisply it moves to do it. And I was reading about his coach's resume. For a young man, he has been all over the country trying to apply to Toronto, knocking down the three pointer. And Richie Riley, his enthusiasm is infectious and an important answer. I'll just say, I'll just tell you that. Well, I'm going to put it on my favorites <laughs> list. <laughs> Justin Powell, after a very solid first half. Now, if you're, if you're a player like Powell, you got to find some openness. At 12 in the opening half on four or five from three-point range, and Johnny heard you. And, and a great screen out of Auburn's doing defensively, and they're scoring any way they really want to score. Can they get a stop, though? That's important. Remember, they made their last five shots to close out the half. Here's Powell again. Wow. You know, talk to the Denver Broncos about that, right? All the yeah. quarterbacks yeah. had to be out because they weren't careful enough because it's a contact tracing thing. As if he's sitting out, he is able to participate in all activities. So hopefully that young man will be ready. Upgrade your basketball programs. And you see the great coaches that have come into this success at other places. New or coaching timeouts. How can they handle this pressure? How much pressure is going to be put on? And he trusts him with the basketball and trusts him how he's going to perform. He's done. And both will have a chance to, to maybe win that tournament and get in the NCAA. Teams are going to make 20-plus threes against us. <laughs> Not many.